Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we are doing a fashion haul. I'm super excited to be showing you guys this. I have stuff from Nasty Gal, I have stuff from um, Verge Girl, I have stuff, I just have a lot of stuff. So I'd rather just jump into it and show you guys all these pieces and like always, I will have everything linked down below for you guys and if I have any kind of discount codes, I will link those also down below. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and let's just jump right into the haul. First thing I actually have from Nasty Gal is this cute hat. I thought I would be spending summer in the sun and you know spring in the sun but I haven't really been wearing this. However, the sun is coming out more so now and even though we are inside and supposed to stay home, I obviously go outside a lot with my kid just to kind of get some sun and get out of the house and just go on a bike ride or walk around or play like nearby the house but I feel like I can wear this hat now I just feel so like I should be in like Italy or like France drinking like some mimosa or like a champagne or something I don't know I just really love this hat it's so cute and it's so flattering, no? Every summer and spring, I always make sure I get like a new hat. This is a really cute one. I'll link it down below as per usual. My nose is running. Why is my nose running? Another piece from Nasty Gal. I'm so excited about these shorts because like I said, it is getting warmer out and I feel like I don't have to always be wearing pants. I just feel like I've been living in pants for like 365 days. So now I feel like I can wear shorts. For me, I'm gonna tell you guys a little bit of a secret. I'm very insecure about my legs. It's something I've been insecure about since I was in high school. I don't really have a ton of muscle. It's something I'm working on trying to build muscle and things like that. And this is just like the inner thigh part of my legs. Now that I'm saying it out loud, all of you guys are going to like pick up on it and like people are totally gonna like just scrutinize me for it or just like make fun of me for it, but whatever. I like these shorts because they kind of cover that little part, top high part of my thigh. I don't know, it's just this weird thing I have. Call me crazy. I, I, it's, I can't help it, okay? So I really like these. I love the color of these. I'm gonna wear this a lot throughout the summer. I can already tell. And hopefully if we get our summer back, which I don't think we're going to, but it's not gonna stop me from dressing cute whenever I need that little pick-me-up. They're just bright and fresh and I like them because they just will go with anything. Um, another pair of shorts that I got, um, you know, spring and summer, I always get a hat and a new pair of denim shorts and I always am looking for the right pair of denim shorts I obviously only wear high-waisted anything I really liked the wash of these and the cut of these I thought were really cute they fit me pretty well <coughs> excuse me I just all of a sudden felt really nasally and congested I don't want to be getting sick pick up some shorts before they sell out because shorts tend to be very high demand in summer, obviously. So uh, I keep getting these emails on my iPad and my iPad's sitting right in front of me and I can't not look at it. I'm just getting very distracted. Wow, that Celsius is kicking in. Yet again from Nasty Gal, we're still on Nasty Gal, but um, it's this bodysuit. I just think it's so cute. It really reminds me of a swimsuit. If this was a swimsuit, I would literally wear it because I love one pieces. I love plunging one pieces. I think it's so cute. The little ties kind of make it a little bit more feminine and a little bit more girly. So I actually bought this a little while ago in hopes that I would be going on vacation. This summer I was planning on doing like a tropical vacation, but obviously now clearly going to be postponed for a while. I thought this would be really great for you know summertime when it's hot throwing this on with some denim shorts that hat and some slip-ons and like a nice big tote and the fabric is really soft it doesn't feel like it's pulling up my butthole you know what I mean like where it's so tight and like wedgy like it's a stretchy enough material but it also hugs you in the right places I just really like nasty gals bodysuits I've have I have probably like three nasty gal bodysuits and I like all of them because they're super comfortable, they're soft, and they're just not like riding up my butt. So this is a really cute um, chambray, is that the right thing? I don't know if that's even a thing, I might have just made it up. I thought this was kind of like, kind of was a little bit cowgirly, but I liked it because I thought it could be a very like 
high fashion look where I did an all denim look um, with some high waisted denim with this. I tried to kind of emulate the similar look that I was going for in the split screen when I was trying this on, but I don't know if I fully successfully did it, but just stay tuned on Instagram. I'll eventually wear the look I'm looking for, but this shirt was super cute. I love how the sleeves are a little bit ruffled right here, so it gives it a little bit more of like a feminine touch to it. So another shirt I got is this Nasty Gal. Um, it's like this olive green ruched shirt. I just had really great ideas with the shirt. It's so cute and flattering. Like, look at how adorable it is. It's like this smocked material. It kind of reminds me, gives me like Snow White vibes, but like in a very modern day setting, but very fashionable. I don't know if that makes sense, but it just makes sense in my brain. This color is really pretty and very flattering, especially now that I just recently dyed my hair darker again. Um, I just think it's a very good contrast for me. So good way to put in color, but still a little bit neutral. So this is my favorite dress so far. I feel like I was hoping I would have like a date night on vacation and I would be able to wear something where it was like really hot and tropical and I was like super tan and had like a little bit of a sun-kissed glow going on. This dress is so pretty. It's very like Super Mermaid vibes. Like I was just washed ashore and like I just need a sheet to drape over me so I can like walk around and like seamlessly wear this. This is literally what it reminds me of because it's just so effortless but it's so sexy. It has this very deep V neck which is so beautiful. It's got little openings in the right places if you know what I mean I'm being gross but I'm literally just saying like I really feel some type of way when I wear this I just feel so pretty and sexy and like elegant at the same time because it's long it's like a long maxi dress I'm just like oh sorry I'm my sheet is just <laughs> draped all over me <laughs> so stupid. I have this dress from Beginning Boutique that is also a very very fresh spring dress what is happening? This is a very cute off the shoulder dress. It is very flattering on one shoulder top, but it has this little peekaboo opening in the shoulder. And then the bottom part of it is so cute because it just sucks you in. This smocked material right here um, just sucks you in in the right places, but it's still like so flattering. It's so girly. And even though I'm not like the most girly dresser, I loved the way that it fit on me. Like I felt some type of a way about my body when I had it on and I was like, oh girl. But I just really like it and it's very breezy. Uh, I just feel like being in Greece with this would be so cute, but that's just me. And by the way, I'm sorry I keep touching my hair. I'm just not used to having it down without my extensions in, but I'm just trying to embrace trying to embrace what I have, okay? I have um, a few pieces from Verge Girl. I found them on Instagram. This one is a really cute top. I actually wore this with those um, taupe beige um, flowy shorts that I mentioned in the beginning of this video. This top is super cute and if you have boobs, it will look even cuter on you than it does on me. Um, I am flat chested as flat can be. I always wear a bra with some sort of chicken cutlet whenever I wear tops like this just to give myself a little femme. You know, I had a baby and I lost my boobs. So that's just what happens. I make do with what I have until one day I will get my boob job. I will. I'm just not in a rush to do it, okay? I don't know if you guys can see it in um, the camera and I'm not sure if it picked up on it, but it has this really nice shimmer throughout, like a little reflex that I think is just so beautiful. And I, you know, I'm not very big on like shimmer and metallics in my clothing. But this is done in a very light way and I just, I think it's so pretty and so cute. So very easy top to wear all the time. Another really, really flattering top from Verge Girl is this. Feels very stiff, but I promise you when you put it on, you're very thankful that it's stiff because it holds you in in the right places. Nothing is more annoying, annoying than a crop top that consistently rises or you have to like pull down. And this one just fits you really well. Kind of feels corsetti where you just feel like secure in it you know what I mean this is super cute because you can wear it up on your shoulders or you can wear it like off the shoulder and it's so girly and it's so pretty I would love to wear this with like flowy white linen pants or something if you have some boobies it's got a little pocket for your little boob but I unfortunately don't have that excess boob to place in there so my bra sits in here so that's fine from Verge Girl I got these beautiful Tiger King pants <laughs> I just 
Just kidding. Oh my god, I can't with myself. Anyway, I cannot look at these pants. Carol Baskin. These pants, unfortunately, they are a little too big for me. I tried to model them in the shot just so that you could kind of see what they would look like on if they really fit, but I kept having to like hold the pants up um, because they are really big and they are an extra small. These are really like these are really big. When I saw on the website, I was like, this is so freaking cute. I felt like with like something toned down at top up top, but it had this little peekaboo thing. And I try to show it in the split screen, but I don't know if you guys can really fully see it. I mean, they're still cute. They're just too big. So I'm going to have to figure out what I'm going to do with these. I have this one top from Windsor store that I wanted to include because I just think Windsor store has some really cute pieces as well. This reminds me of my mom. My mom would never wear this because it's like more cropped. I think she has something like this, but like longer. I love tops that are this length because they are very flattering right here when they have this like smocked ruching. Um, it kind of just pulls your waist in a little bit. And then with something high waisted, this looks so cute on. I love this top a lot. So highly recommend. I know this dress is from Shop Rumors. Oh my God. This dress is literally, it's so effortlessly sexy just because it's black and it's silky. It is one of those like slip dresses that you could wear at any time of the day. It's just so pretty on and if you're a little bit more curvaceous than me, I mean, slip dresses are everything for the curved body and I'm extremely, extremely jealous, but nonetheless, I still wear it. It's so cute, it's very comfortable and just like the quality of this is so nice and well-made. Highly recommend this one. I also love the little detail right here that kind of comes up a little bit. It's just very flattering. I love it. I have this bodysuit. I'm going to link where I got it from. It's either from Beginning Boutique or Shop Rumors. I cannot remember for the life of me. I'm so sorry, but I'll link it down below and let you guys know where it's from. Everybody needs a one shoulder long sleeve bodysuit. It's just so cute on. This is a very comfortable one. This is super soft. It's like a very nice cotton material. It's not too tight. It just it feels great. I really like the fact that like if you're ever out and about and you have these clasp at the bottom, you can just like undo it and pee rather than having to like literally get naked in a stall. That is, it's like such an awkward, ugh. I just always appreciate it and the butt is a thong. So if you decide to wear something that's a little bit more sheer or a little bit more tight denim pant, you're not gonna see the lining of like the butt. It's more like a thong so you won't see the lining of the bodysuit. So I really like it. I got it in a small. I'll also have all the sizes of everything linked below. So I think that is it. That concludes this little haul. I am going to be putting out more hauls very soon. I have a ton of clothing sitting on that rack that is still waiting to be shown to you guys. So stay tuned. If you want to see more fashion hauls, give this video a thumbs up. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and follow me on Instagram. And until next time, I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.